Hello everyone. Welcome back to the game I haven't made a video on in a very long time, and that's Miner's Haven. You might be wondering why. The main reason is because there's really nothing left to do. In terms of making actual progress, there isn't. I've hit what I consider to be a good amount of lives. And, you know, considering all the exploits that have still not been fixed on this game, I've had no more motivation to even try to get to the top rebirths because there's just people who can run setups without even playing the game and they can just easily get higher. So, yeah, I'm done with that. Until that gets patched, which it probably won't, then, uh, I don't see what else to do. Someone's lagging the server badly. I'm guessing it's that first life. Gee, what the? What are they running over there? Anyway. The, the basic setup is just this at this point. Like, there's nothing else to do. So. The... The current state of Miner's Haven is that it's just kind of been sitting in the dust for a while. And the chance of it getting an update anytime soon is very little. Because... Mereza's latest tweet said, Working on the Miner's Haven update will be out late September. So, uh, yeah, you guys can not expect a Miner's Haven video anytime soon. What is happening? Oh, sweet. That person's completely stupid and doesn't realize that entire base is closed. Excellent. You know, of course we still got some smart players playing Miner Saving. <sighs> Idiots. How old do these people have to be to not get it? This is my... It... There's a tutorial. It tells you what to do. You put a thing over a thing and then you make things. It's not that hard, but apparently it's some of the hardest stuff people have ever done. To be fair, when I first started playing this, it wasn't that hard, but... Or it wasn't that easy, but it, it was... Well, back then, when I first joined this game, there was only four Reborn items, and the game was much different than it is now. Now, I, I'm basically going to be talking about the future of Miner's Haven, considering... I am still going to be making Miner's Haven videos, but mainly only when there's updates. So, for example, I'm going to be still making setup videos, and I will eventually be making challenges. Um, once I can find some actual good ones, because to be honest, you guys didn't give me very good ones. At least not ones that I've already made videos on that aren't just terrible anyway. So... I joined Miner's Haven back in July 2015, and it was quite the game back then. I was quite attached to it, and by the end of 2015, I was the biggest life in Miner's Haven with uh, quite a decent amount of competition, and it was a much different game at the time. The PvP was actually enjoyable, and the setups were fun to make, and it was the game was actually harder. I kind of completely lost, uh, the game completely lost skill in my opinion once the morning stars became a thing. Not even the catalyzed stars, which are a whole nother level of just death, but I've already swung into that field and it wasn't a good idea, so, because a lot of you have a different opinion on that, but I don't know anymore about Miner's Haven. It's just kind of there. I mean, I know this is the game that made me big, and I know it's why the most of you are on my channel subscribed is because of the Miner's Haven video. Or videos. So, just let me know what you guys think. I mean, I'll still be making Miner's Haven videos. They just won't be as often. And, uh, I'll show you my life currently. I'm life 1262. Not impressive at all, but it's it's a life, I guess. It's a life I don't have. Just like those 10,000s who got there in two days because they cheated. Okay, well, this thing still is 
bad, I believe. I think it's only still a, uh, um, a thousand times, so that's great. This thing's permanently going to be a lot more garbage than the uh, Ultimate Sacrifice. It's basically just a bigger Ultimate Sacrifice that's not an Ultimate Sacrifice, and it's just bad. It doesn't even look as cool as the Ultimate Sacrifice, in my opinion. Like, yes, I like the cool, like, conveyor, but why does it have to be three wide? That is so irritating. Why did this have to be a three wide upgrader? Just to make it extra hard to use? It's called the final upgrader. You'd think it'd be a little powerful, but, you know, I guess not. Uh, I'm gonna rebirth at least once in this video. Like, uh, for example, the challenge on the, uh, Duel to Cillian, I've already made a video on that, and that's the Overlord Device Farm video. You guys could go find that somewhere. If you wanna watch it. Oh. Dragon Glass Blaster. Do I even have... How many of those do I have? Three? whoop de doo Alright, so... I think I'm done with this video. Let me know what you guys currently think about Miner's Haven. 166 Warhammer stands, huh? I'll just place a few of those. I'm bored. I'm in the dark on this game. I will be making setup videos and challenges pretty soon here, but not very soon. So, I'll see you guys later on Miner's Haven. Like, this is definitely not it. I might even be on free build. I think I'm going to make a free build episode next. To see if I can rebirth on free build without death happening. So, I think I'll see you guys there next. Bye. Lag. That person's stupid. I swear.